Hey all my divas out there, Snappy Mac Diva 3 here and um, today I'm actually starting a little series of different looks for like um, most women if you're trying to find a look to wear you just want to know about natural makeup um, or more natural look to wear to work every day. So um, here's the look I'm going for. It's like basically just a brown eye, um, very pretty colors. Um, easy to do and just to let you know so far I already put on my um, MAC full coverage foundation and my NYC smooth skin loose face powder and actually I already um, did my brows with the brow gel and this brow gel is actually from Ulta works very, works very um, well too so it's cheaper than MAC good to get so to start off so I'm gonna go ahead and get started and one of the reasons why I decided to go ahead and do a series like this is because I have a lot of friends who um, they don't like to wear a lot of makeup but sometimes they want a I don't know more cleaner look but I'm gonna use my um, Urban Decay Primer Potion first just a slight dab don't need a lot and rub that all over my lid like I said I have a lot of friends who they want to they don't like to wear some of the brighter colors that I love they like a more neutral look which is the look actually that I started with when I start wearing makeup I was wearing more of a natural look browns um, colors that blend it into my skin look more natural on me so I'm gonna start with um, glamour check which is that's the color right there from the uh, star flash or the love that look collection and I'm just taking my 239 brush so if you have a brush like the 239 and I'm just applying it all over my lid from the inner crease to the outer crease I mean the inner corner to the outer corner duh and that is such a pretty brown color it gives a little shimmer this is even a good look you can wear for an interview then I'm taking my 226 a crease brush and I'm using a little folly which is that color right there just like a brown both these colors have like brownish red in it which I feel goes well with my um, skin complexion and two of my friends who um, were looking for more neutral looks are close to my complexion one's a little darker actually both are probably a little darker than me just a tad bit so I figure these are good colors but I just put that in my crease it's just a matte color because I feel you know in the crease especially as you're getting older matte colors work kind of well so I'm just blending that really well and then next one I'm taking is my 225 brush which MAC actually doesn't sell but if you have a big fluffy brush like this or even um, the Beauty of Essence brush, the eyeshadow brush that can work well also yeah a lot of good brushes out there but I'm taking my favorite pigment which is uh, Provence and just dab a little in there and I always get a little too much so shake that off, tap that off and I put that up right um, underneath my eyebrow, my brow bone. And since I have such a light color, or since I have a matte color here, um, I normally don't bring it down here, but I'm bringing it down um, towards my inner corner. And blending that out. So you don't see any sharp edges because it's supposed to be a soft look. I gotta say something you can wear to the office um, or if you're going on a job interview 
just a nice look for the eye neutral so this is more or less my neutral series and the next thing that I use is the L'Oreal telescopic eyeliner move my mirror over just a little bit so I can do this um, and I just apply a thin line to my eye nothing real heavy because like I say if you're have a very conservative job or you have um, an interview and you just want a nice look Hold on one second. Yeah, if you basically just want a nice look, this is something, you know, that can really work out. And then I'm going to apply, it's just a uh, Volume Exact by CoverGirl mascara. Any mascara do, as long as you know. I mean, you don't really want to use like a blue, purple, because of course you know you want a more neutral color so that's something that'll look nice and not overboard for an interview or for a job or if you're just going on a date and the guy likes you to look more natural but you want to have you know your makeup on you just want a light touch but I thought this is a real pretty look And since it's summertime, depending on if you um where you're going, sometimes you may not want to line your lower line or even put mascara at the bottom because sometimes it can um run, depending on what you're using. And I did use a little liner just to fix my brows a little bit because they're not as thick as they used to be. But I don't want it too thick because then, you know, they're looking at me funny doing an interview like, okay, what's one with her eyebrows? And then I'm just taking a NARS um, lip gloss in Dolce Vita or lipstick. And it's just a light neutral color. Because most interviews I've gone to, I've never really worn like a red color or anything. And not ever will. Some jobs even frown upon you wearing like a red color. And this is just a Dote Vita um, lip gloss to go with it. So there's the eyes. Nice brown color. Um, nice neutral colors. And now I'm just going to add on a light blush. And using peach, using Melba. I was going to say peach Melba, but it's called Melba <laughs> by Mac. And Mac still does carry this. And I'm just using my 168 brush. Just add a little on the cheeks. Just give me a light flush of color. there is my work interview slash do you just want to look natural for natural kind of more natural look for a date look and I hope all my divas love it but like I said it's just a neutral look you have an interview or something works great for it but I hope you all have a wonderful and marvelous day and I will speak to all my divas later and see ya